So I'm just getting back from a trip. And traveling with your guitar can be a real pain in the especially if you're traveling by airplane. Ooh, coffee. Ah, that's good. So most of the work that I do is right here in New York. And it's been a little while since I've had to travel by airplane with my guitar. So when I took the gig that I'm just now getting back from, it was kind of time for me to reassess my means of guitar transportation. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Oh, coffee. So up until this point, I kind of had one of two speeds as far as transporting guitars is concerned. I have this option, which is the super portable and easy to travel with, yet not so protective option. It's got some functionality to it, but ultimately not quite the protection that I'm looking for when it comes to airline travel. Moving on. And then you got something like this, which is the case that your guitar comes with, which is just clunky and heavy. And like a great option when you're on the road and you're stacking other pieces of large gear on top of it. But ultimately this isn't something that's gonna fit nicely in the overhead compartment or make your life very easy when you're going through security. Security! So basically this is all the protection you want, just none of the portability really. It's not so bad, but like, also not that great. We're okay. So I guess I was looking for the happy medium between ultra portable and ultra protective. Mono bags are a product that I've wanted to check out for a little while, and now seemed like as good a time as any. My needs led me to the M80 electric guitar cases, which have a few different variations, but I was deciding between the guitar sleeve and the Vertigo guitar case, which is a little bit more robust, a little more rugged, and also a hundred dollars more than the guitar sleeve. I did some research and found some different comparisons. I'll link some of that information below for you. Ultimately, I decided on the M80 guitar sleeve because it was a hundred bucks cheaper, but I did have my concerns about the protectiveness of the guitar case, especially when it comes to airline travel. Now, after owning this guitar case for only a week, I obviously can't speak to the lifespan of this case. I don't know how it's gonna hold up over time, but what I do know is that Mono Bags offers a lifetime warranty, which is very comforting. So first off the bat, let's just talk about the craftsmanship of this bag. Excellent, A plus for craftsmanship. Comfortability, I mean, I'm just gonna wear it right now. It's that comfortable. I just like, I wanna sit here and wear it and talk to you, but I had to like reveal it first. But I'm just gonna, We'll just sit. That's comfort, right there. It's comfortable to carry. Just carrying it, you can, you can carry it from, from here, from this strap. Tricep exercises, what up? You can carry it over here. But yeah, in all seriousness guys, this is an extremely comfortable bag. Very sturdy, reinforced straps, and it like, somehow makes your guitar feel very compact and also safe, also secure. This is your baby, and you want your baby to be safe. I'm ridiculous. I'm, I'm in rare form today, gang. Lucky you. <laughs> anyway, it's got this pouch in the front, which I'll show you in a bit, but if you can see, I like that. There are the, uh, the little zippers, little zip, zip ties. They're very nice. They got little rubber grippies on the zipper, which make uh, opening and closing the bag a breeze, an utter breeze. And like, if you're, if you need some like samples for your mixtape, model bags got you covered, fam. But in all seriousness, this bag is super comfortable, super portable. Your guitar is gonna be nice and secure. Um, it was a, a total breeze getting this through security. And it fits nice and comfortably in the overhead compartment, just like that. I had to have a couple of people put a bag or two on top, but you know what? This is nice and cushioned and I didn't mind. I was like, hey, sir, ma'am, go ahead, put your bags right on top. It's all good. Nice and safe. This bag's got more cushion for the, for the, for your bags. Anyway, let's check out the interior of the bag, shall we? 
All right, so first let's talk about the storage of the bag. Let me get right in and show you exactly what I carried with me on my recent trip. One quarter inch guitar cable, a music notebook, some guitar accessories, whammy bar, capo, picks, string cleaner, and a cloth. And last but not least, my Vox AC2 mini guitar amp that I use to practice with. Just a side note, this thing is awesome. I did a review, I'll link that somewhere, but you should check this out. Little side note, how dope are these Chewbacca socks? Anyway, the storage pouch is kept closed here with this very strong stainless steel clip. It says designed for creators on it. Then it's got this seatbelt strap here that holds everything together like such. Inside, you just saw how much I can fit in it, but it's got one main large compartment and then a smaller zipper compartment as well. The main guitar compartment zips open like this and it loads from the top. As you can see, out comes your guitar. Inside the case has this nice rest here for your guitar's neck keeping it from bouncing around too much inside the bag. It's got this vinyl portion up here which protects the case from getting torn up by your guitar strings. And it also has something similar down here as well. Down in the bottom here, it's gonna be kinda hard to see, but there is a little cutout for the nut at the bottom of the guitar that you attach your guitar strap to. And it just really nestles the guitar in there nice and tight, prevents any movement inside the case. Really well thought out. Now the bottom of the Vertigo cases have this big rubber sole, almost like a big boot on the bottom. And I was worried about this sleeve not having enough protection. But as you can see, kind of starting right here and wrapping all the way around the bottom, is this really thick, rugged fabric that definitely looks like it's gonna be able to stand up against its fair share of wear and tear. You can see here just how thick this case is. It's a good inch and a half, two inches of solid foam protection. All in all, this is a very protective case, very lightweight, very portable case. It's gonna make you feel nice and comfortable that your guitar is safely tucked away. All right, guys, so I hope this was a fun little quirky review for you. Just overall, I really love this bag. I love when I get a product that I am pleasantly surprised with. Mono bags A+. If you feel like you gotta spend the extra hundred on the Vertigo bag, by all means, go for it. But I, for one, am completely happy and satisfied with the guitar sleeve. Thanks so much for commenting and liking and subscribing and supporting this new and growing channel. If there's any product you would like me to review or topics you would like to hear me discuss, leave it in the comment below. I would love to hear from you guys. Until next time, my name's Patrick, and I'll see you in the next one, all right? Peace. Is somebody like, you guys hear that? The whole movie's dead, that was pretty loud. Anyway, I think we're clear. This has gotta be a joke. Let's continue with the review, shall we? Now that freaking Bob the Builder downstairs is done fucking hammering away. <laughs>